I think it's important to photograph Mother Nature in an authentic way, without AI or Photoshop, to remind people that these places really do exist. You can get out and experience them for yourself. My name is Joshua Cripps, and I'm a wilderness landscape photographer. We're out here in my backyard in the Alabama Hills near Lone Pine, California, and we're using the new OnePlus 12 to capture the moon. The moon is something that we all have in common. You can look up in the sky and see the same as somebody on the other side of the world, but it is so far away. I love to bring it down to earth to make it feel like something that you can reach out and touch. One of the big challenges with this project is using a smartphone to photograph the moon. It's something I'd never done before. So we're doing three months of camera tests to make sure the phone's got enough dynamic range and that the different zoom levels of the periscope telephoto lens can capture enough detail. Oh, this looks amazing. Okay, great job. Relax for a second. I'm gonna reset and go farther back. For this particular shoot, the moon is only gonna be in this orientation twice per year. So we had to have a good weather window. We're at this beautiful moment of golden sunlight and the thickest cloud in the sky is right where the moon is at. You have to get your timing perfect when the sun is also up illuminating the landscape. Otherwise, the contrast is too big and the landscape's gonna to be totally dark. The moon is just barely visible under the underside of that cloud now. So here we go. That sky looks so good. For me, the gear is only as important as it allows me to achieve my artistic vision. So I wanna use the best tools that I can. I've been really impressed with the fourth gen Hasselblad camera and its ability to render natural light and shadow. It really feels like using a SLR. Before the shoot, if you had showed me these photos and told me they're from a smartphone, I wouldn't have believed you. 